Hello and welcome to another chess video tutorial. Yes it is me GM the baby convertible Josh on Nakamura Limited. Are you tired of losing every game? If yes, then continue watching till the end so I can force you to like and subscribe. If no then like and subscribe anyway and still watch the video till the end. Now let's get into the video with this amazing intro that I totally made and didn't search on Google free YouTube intro cool note co. P right. First you need to be white pieces and move e4, a standard move. If he responds with d5 then it's working and he's gonna lose. So move knight to f3, sacrificing our pawn so he takes it and we move our knight to g5 attacking the pawn. And he responds with horse to f6 protecting da pawn. Now we sacrifice another pawn and we move pawn to d3. If he takes our pawn then we take it back with a bishop eating it. Nom, nom, nom. He is probably very intimidated of our horse in g5 so he moves pawn to h3 saying shoo shoo. So we take the pawn on f7 with our horse forking the queen and rook. He can't do anything to save both rook and queen unless taking our knight. But this is exactly what we wanted. So now we put our bishop that is on d3 to g6. The king cannot retreat because the bishop is attacking the path back so the best move for black is to take our bishop. Now the black queen is exposed and the next move is obvious. We launch the R32 KL FA69 420A A J K E double pan U A P A W E L I N K. W E L I N K A 76 2 E is USSR B2 code 440 liters RT2 PM32 number 5 quad with the intercontinental ballistic missile to attack the remaining pieces. But if you are a noob at weaponing pieces then you can use the triple cannon shotgun cavalry 527 from the military, but you will figure it out alone. Now look carefully what happens to black's pieces. Now white has material advantage and developed pieces. So with this we finish. Thank you for hatching and remember to like and subscribe or I launch the RT 2pm in you at 3am. See you in the next tutorial and bye.